one thing also is that that I know I suffer from and it's kind of like all oh, the crap that has happened in the past every little thing I hate the fact that I can remember everything I like it's a blessing and a curse at the same time but it's like in any relationship I always assume the worst you know I, I never I used to let me correct that I used to now I understand that if I think ahead of time, what I am creating is I am creating an anxiety gap, which means an anxiety gap is when you're kind of going through something and you start thinking ahead of time. But you got to remember, you can't think ahead of time because you can't do anything about that time. The only thing you can control is the now, the present, not the past and not the future, the now. So that's why it's important to be in the now, not the, oh my God, so-and-so's a this and so-and-so's a that. You know, I could sit here, I could say probably about 80% of the people that known me in the past are probably like, oh, she was a, an it, ooh, you know, now it's different. Now I'm <laughs> welcoming one thing. Don't mind helping people who need help. You know, I'm always an open ear to people. Back then, I wouldn't. I would have been, fuck him, fuck her. That's what I would have said. But now, I give the, not, not the benefit of the doubt, but I always think outside. Because you never know what one person is going through. For instance, I'm very good as, when I go, go outside, I'm good at masking how I feel. Until I boil everything up and then, poof, you know, I explode. And that is something that I've worked on to not get there. Because now, when I feel it, I'm very good at, hey, so-and-so, I feel like this. You know, Manny, I'm feeling anxious. Like, I'm very good at voicing it now versus trying to mask it because I don't have to mask it. Nobody should ever have to mask their emotion. It's your emotion. You're entitled to that emotion. You know, and if you need to speak to somebody, just say, you know, I need to talk to you. And whatever I have to say, I just have to let it off my chest and just allow me and go from there. And one thing that I learned from my dad is that, you know, if the conversation doesn't go right, you agree to disagree. There's nothing wrong with that. Absolutely nothing wrong with that. But this world is just so fucked up, you know? It really is. You got so many people who just don't even give the people the chance to even show that they've changed. You know? Like... People still judge you on that. Like, oh, she's still the same. But yet, yeah, because I look mad all the time, you know, well, screw you then, you know. Better for you because if I get along with you, I'm talking all the damn time. Or laughing and joking or pulling pranks, something. But it's, don't, the point is don't judge people off the back. You know, really don't. Because everybody is going through something in this world. Everybody. We just show it differently. Some people get mad, some people drink, some people get high, you know, some people go clubbing, some people, everything's different. But drinking's a no-no, you know, and getting high is a no-no as well. You know, that's not gonna help you either. It's gonna just drown you, FYI. But yeah, this growth is something and it's something beautiful so yeah that's how the cookie crumbles